welcome back from the vlog today we are coloring iron so i'm about to show you my new workout it's a push pull legs kind of split if you know me you know that usually i don't really do or like push pull legs uh just because i feel like i'm not doing enough even if i get to failure on each set plus i do like to focus on one muscle group every day and when i do that i feel like I'm actually uh, working those muscles, focusing those muscles way more. Before we dive into the workout, remember to like, comment, share, subscribe, all the good shit. You guys know that the support is always appreciated. Okay, so I don't know if you guys can see this, but this is my personal app where um, this is the app that my clients use. This was the first uh, warm up set. It was chest play machine. I did three sets, control reps with one second squeeze. We did one set of 15, one set of 12, and one set of 10. And I just keep track of all my shit in my app as well as, you know, I do for my clients. Next is going to be dumbbell incline bench press or chest press, whatever you want to call it. We have four sets, 8 to 12 reps. The first couple sets, I'm going to shoot for 12 reps, you know, 10, 10 to 12 reps. And then if the last set, the last two sets, I can only shoot for 8 because the weight gets too heavy. I'm still fine with it. As long as I'm eating failure, I'm good with it. But let's get into it. Once again, I probably fucked up the audio. Um, I don't know when this happened, so if I did fucked up the audio, you guys will find out. But we're done with the real deaths. Uh, we're switching to some lateral races. Uh, sitting right here, I'm gonna do um probably a drop set. I'm trying to eat at least six to eight heavy reps, and then drop uh around like 20, 25 percent of the way, and go to failure. So, yeah kind of be stuff about the audio shit but whatever this is it let's get into it Downs. We're gonna move in this dip machine. Just end this workout. Looking bomb, looking good. So we're done with the workout. Only thing left is cardio. 30 minutes on the treadmill. So definitely something that i'm gonna change in those workout uh probably volume uh and i think the way i'm gonna do this as i think i was saying this at the beginning of the video um i'm probably gonna either do a different split every 14 days or since i'm gonna do like push pull legs one rest day uh and then push pull legs again probably the second push pull legs it's gonna be a different type of exercise. Uh, I still, like I feel I gave my all today, uh, but since I'm so used to my volume, which is like high volume, um, I feel like I am more shit in the bank. 
both for chest and shoulders um there's some stuff that you guys probably not gonna see in this video some warm-ups that i did some feeder sets uh which you know still brings me uh, closer to failure but uh it's definitely not enough and when you're doing like a push day if i'm doing i did three chest exercise two shoulder exercise uh, two tricep exercise and like the fact that i feel that i could have done more and i still have something in the dang which i'm still like i'm tired like you know what i mean but i've been here for like two hours because like you can only do so much in two hours and i'm not planning on being here for like three hours you know what i mean plus cardio so yeah i don't know if i can just stick to this uh I will try, as I was saying, I will try to keep this for eight to 16 weeks. And I think the only way I can actually do this is to switch my workouts every 14 days, or as I was saying, do the first three push pull legs some way, and then do different exercises, like eat different fibers, eat different angles on, sorry, on my second uh, push pull legs for the week. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all the good shit. You know that support's always appreciated. Thank you for tuning in. Damiano here. Hold on now. Out.